Welcome back, everybody, to another edition of Coin Toss, the 411, where we try to bring you the latest in crypto and NFT news. And today, Honduras signals intent to follow neighboring El Salvador in making Bitcoin legal tender. So let's get it. President Zirmana Castro says El Salvador shouldn't be the only country to rid itself of dollar reliance. Honduras may be the next country to adopt Bitcoin as legal tender, a move that would rock the legacy establishment. Bitcoin bull Max Kaiser initially floated rumors of this happening in a tweet posted last Friday. It read, It's happening, accompanied by a picture of the Honduras flag. According to Bitcoin Lightning Network, the president of Honduras, Zeromara Castro said El Salvador cannot be the only country to rid itself of dollar. Quote, we must not allow El Salvador to be the only country escaping dollar hegemony. Honduras has the right to move towards the first world countries. End quote. Bitcoin is increasingly seen as an escape from the dollar. They say all fiat currencies eventually go to zero. History shows that rampant debt and currency devaluation only ends one way. Recently, cracks in dollar dominance have become further evident. As unpopular as it may sound, we might be witnessing the end of the dollar in real time as entities look at alternatives. For example, talks between China and Saudi Arabia to trade oil in yuan have accelerated due to dissatisfaction with America's security commitment to the Saudis. If successful, the move would severely impair the dollar's oil market dominance. As well as that, Russia has increasingly turned to the yuan as a response to sanctions over the Ukraine war. It's reported that Russian firms are scrambling to open yuan accounts to keep cash flowing. However, James Folk, author of the book Financial Cold War, A View of Sino-U.S. Relations from the Financial Market, says despite the apparent dollar flight, the yuan won't be Usurping the dollar anytime soon. Folks says China's tight capital controls and rule of law make the yuan unappealing versus the dollar. Quote, but that doesn't mean the renminbi is going to suddenly start rivaling the dollar in any meaningful way. And in order for it to do so, you have a lot of other pieces that have to fall into place. Nonetheless, the emergence of Bitcoin offers an alternative to both the yuan and the dollar. On top of this, its fixed supply means it cannot be inflated to zero. Moreover, being apolitical, it also has appeal based on staying out of factional wranglings. How might the price react if Honduras goes ahead? When El Salvador made Bitcoin legal tender on September 7, 2021, BTC experienced a 20% swing to the downside, bottoming at 42800 this triggered a downtrend for the rest of September, hitting a local bottom of 39500 before bulls broke the downtrend, rallying to a new all-time high of 69000 some six weeks later. Based on the notion of government approval by Bit of Bitcoin, September 7th was primarily expected to be a catalyst for a move higher. Instead, the flash crash scene defied expectation. Co-founder of on-chain capital, Ranu Nur, suggests foul play at the hands of legacy institutions. In a recent tweet, he said, So on the exact day that El Salvador launches Bitcoin as legal tender against the wishes of the World Bank and IMF, mysteriously every single major exchange goes down at the same time as the price crashes by 20%. Nonetheless, based on a sample of one, a country making Bitcoin legal tender will likely crash the price, at least in the short term. For now, it's all eyes on Honduras. We recently reported news of Malaysia considering making Bitcoin legal tender. Now we see Honduras looking to its neighbor, El Salvador, for reassurance that making Bitcoin legal tender is a good idea. While we believe crypto in general has its benefits, we would like to hear your opinion. So tell us what you think in the comment section down below. If you made it this far in the video, we want to say thank you for watching. And remember, I am not a financial advisor. So if you enjoyed this content, do me a favor. Hit the like and subscribe button as well as the notification bell so you don't miss a thing. Until next time, peace.